A month is classed as Chief Science Officer Dr. Kine reporting. Can you listen to that now? The colony's problems concern me greatly. I have no doubt they are somehow linked to the discovery of the marker, but the exact nature of that connection is still unknown. Almost 40% of the colonists are experiencing a form of dementia. The obvious symptoms are acute depression, insomnia, and hallucination. Incidents of violence and even murder also indicate extreme paranoia. Dr. Mercer has advised that I bring some of the affected on board for study. Dr. Man, where do you come from? ...has reported that his own analysis has been fruitless. I'm hesitant to rely on Dr. Mercer at this point, but I need his expertise. We need solutions. Oh, what the... And we need them quickly. Wait. Could not be serious. There we go, half pack. The other way up. Like I was saying, that guy made me jump by the way, him. Like I was saying, technical definition of a month is four weeks. What's this? Oxygen recharge. Thanks. Anywho. The technical definition of a month is four weeks. Yeah, if you take 52 and divide it by four, it's actually 13. So technically, like in deck of cards, 13 cards per color. No, oh, color. Set? I want to say set. Anyways, yeah. Well, technically, if you take a month as being four weeks, it's actually 13 months in a year. Which also means that from the extra like 2 or 3 days at the end of each month, except for February, even though this year it's a leap year so it's 29, but you know what I mean. Boom. Tell you. There's actually 28 days worth of extra stuff supposedly you know it's quite cool but yes it is my birthday and exactly well that's was my point my birthday is on the 29th of March today is the 29th of February so technically it's a month inverted commas no not technically no it's no not technically in technically or whatever I don't know it's a month away but actually it's four weeks and a day oh oh Jesus what the hell is that? is that a rack? oh bloody hell oh Jesus Why is that? Is that a super mutant? I don't like super mutants. Jesus Christ, that's fast! Did you see how fast that was bloody moving? I mean, Jesus Christ. Codes received, and they look good. Thank God. I'll start accessing the captain's records right now. Head to the tram station, and I'll contact you there. I'm going to find out what the hell happened to this ship. Ooh, power node. Woohoo. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, but that thing was fast. That thing was bloody fast. I wasn't expecting it to break through. Ew. Hi. That's really creepy. <laughs> Get out. Uh, 
What is this? It looks like a rack of borderlands. That's creepy as hell. But I get that the babies turn into the babies. And the people turn into the normal ones. And then... I don't know. The people in wheelchairs turn into people with tails. But... What turns into the weird flying moth racky thing? Because that thing's creepy. Is it the creepy people? The creepy people turn into that. I'm scared now. Look at these dead bodies. What if one of those things comes in and turns them all into super mutants? I don't want super mutants attacking me. Hey, I've been here. Where do I want to be? In here? Apparently so. Hi! I don't know why, but I had a feeling he was behind me. Come on down! Oh, damn it. Too close. Plan worked, though. Supposedly. Yep, did work. Something's gonna jump out of there. Isaac. <laughs> Somehow one of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lockdown now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. <laughs> Shit, we've got bigger problems. The oh. engines are offline and our orbit Hi. is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. Hmm. Right. Swear to you, something's gonna jump out of there. Oh, well. Hi. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship-wide. We need more help. Hi. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds. We are not equipped to deal with this. God. Get up to the table. Hold him. Nurse, you hold him down. Every corner. That was Nicole, right? I can't tell from here when that log was made. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. Yeah, it's probably a necromorph. Pretty sure the word is necromorph. I think that's what they call them. I don't know. Where do I want to be going? Oh, he actually turns around to tell me where to go. That's pretty cool. That could do some damage. <laughs> ah, cool. Small med pack. Where would the world be without small med packs? Be dead. Where am I going? Am I going? To, am I going in here? Uh, yeah, I am. Cool. Chapter 2 Intensive Care Completed. Oh, yeah. Boom. Chicka wow wow. So, why not? Wow, chicka wow wow. Yeah. Course correction. That was bloody quick. Oh. We've got two problems, and we're working on borrowed time here. First, there's no fuel in the engines. Second, the gravity centrifuge is offline, which means there's a couple of trillion tons of rock pulling us down. 
I need you to get that centrifuge operational. Refuel the main engine and fire it up so I can stabilize the ship's orbit. I did just pick up. I don't know. Why is there flamethrower ammo? For God's sake. I have 25. Great. It's useless. It's useless to me. Wait, if I go to inventory, I think I just pick some up. No. No, because it's in the thing, so it doesn't matter. Okay, come on then. <laughs>